So hello there everyone on YouTube, welcome to another episode of this Rohan campaign. Now, we are taking here Eastern Osgiliath, doesn't have a big garrison so that's fine. I'm just checking out if the stream is fine. Yep, it seems like it's, it's fine. Um, then we have, yes. I had this army here, I'm unsure if I should go over here already. I think I can, or I can actually send this army. I think I should. I might just send this army from Cat Andrews. Let me just check if there's any further forces nearby. Yes, there are. There are a couple of. Oh, the dead marshes. Hmm. So there are a couple of armies here. Maybe I can lure them. Your orders, my lord. Well, this army can probably reach this one. Um. So on Cat Andrews. Okay, I'm gonna move all the army because it's very close, and then I'll move anything that I that it gets depleted. Um, afterwards. We shall engage. So there are two troll-like units, you know, all the kind of stuff, but this is a bridge, attack. which means that they won't attack me. So I'll have all the time to pepper them down with ballistas. <laughs> that, good. that was an annoying laugh, wasn't it? I'm sorry. I'm sorry, sometimes I, I can't help myself. I guess all the time. Okay, so... There's only one ballista? Mm, I thought I had more. Okay, so the ballista will certainly need some place to fire, so that's a good spot. I guess so. And I'll have a lot of archers, honestly. No, actually these guys have more range, so let's go with that. I want them to be on the left flank in case they, they start, can start firing over here. I guess it goes for it. Okay, the horse archers. I can put them here. Why not? And now the most important things are actually the infantry forces that will cover the bridge. Probably these guys. There we go. Uh, this guy, this guy, this guy. Let's stay back. The rest is cavalry forces, which is, you know, annoying for bridge battles. So let's start it up. Okay, so you, sirs, can actually start attacking these trolls. Should I use fire ammunition? Not sure. Okay, they are firing at will. So, let's see if they are actually hitting the trolls or not. Let's see that. Come on. Show me the fire. Are they? I think they are. Okay, they are hitting these guys, so no. Let's attack this guy. Okay, they are actually having to move, which is kind of annoying there. Let me just move here. Time six. Hopefully they won't be in targets of any archers or whatever. He doesn't have any. That's good. I'm actually gonna go uh, for fire ammunition. Oh, Bart is actually uh, hosting me. Thank you, Bart, by the way. It's auto hosting. It's showing up. Hmm, I wonder why my dashboard didn't so, uh, do any sounds or whatever. Okay, let's see, can I capture these guys? Can I kill them? It's nice. One is always good. Two is better. I wish they would have done that. I just put the fire ammunition in case they miss or they actually score some of those orc molars there. Um, that will mean that they will get a lot of extra casualties if possible. They're actually having pretty much the same, um, same hit chance. They do not miss too much on on fire ammunition against trolls. And now uh, when I say this, they just start missing. Come on, hit a couple of these guys. You still gotta kill the other guys, so make sure that you don't waste your ammunition, will you? You hearing me, Ballista guys? I'll have you flawed. Okay, or flayed, or whatever. You know, I'll put you as a Ballista missile, if you don't behave. Oh, there's some more craters there. Okay, let me just stop there because they were moving. Let's hit those all like high. That's good, they're actually in the middle, so I'll always hit some stuff. 
There we go. One last solo. Hi. Let's see if I can keep hitting them. Well, there's a lot of missiles to spend already. Have spent, been spent on me. Okay, that's good. Another one. And I missed everything. Cool. So you're gonna grab that and move away. There we go. So now it's time for the missile troops, I guess. Now they don't have a lot of stuff, so... Yeah, I can pretty much send some units there. Like these guys. Let's see if they will move in against me. I don't know, I'm gonna try to bait them a little bit. Uh, just to see if I can get, you know, some archer fire or something like that. Now they're barely able to shoot over that bridge, you know. I, c I can send them here and they'll be able to. I should actually do so. Let me just put these guys here, fast forward. There we go, they're still covered by these whirling swordsmen. Can you shoot those guys? You cannot. Okay, how about you? Can you move over there and be able to shoot them? You just run. Really want these guys to do so. One, can you shoot those? They cannot. Okay. So let's send these guys over here. There we go. He's probably gonna lure some of these guys. There we go, they're hitting the Olagai, which is quite good. I'd rather see them hitting the Olagai than the other units. So let me just move these guys here and these guys over here. There we go. Okay, they are now moving them in. So that's that's boom. Well, not if I send all of these guys over there. Okay, I'm sending the Olokai killers as well. Hang on a second. There we go, Axemen in. So that should do the trick. Now the Orc Raiders there, these guys probably will die very, very soon. After all, I'm sending a lot of troops here. Okay, let's attack those Orc Raiders. There we go, let's attack those. Let's attack those. There we go. So these guys plus this guy, let's join them up. Let's actually send these guys here. So the Olaghai probably will get a lot of kills here. There's just nothing that I can do, but still, I'll manage to kill off a lot of these other guys. Especially if he tries to send them in. You know, there's still a couple of mountain trolls there. Five mountain trolls. Well, I wish I had another ballista. That would ease it up. But for now, there's nothing that I can do, actually. So, just keeping, keeping these numbers dwindled. Let's get it times two and check the numbers of all guy here. I know that this is the probably the worst position for Olakai to fight. You know, they get a lot of casualties, but they still have a lot of guys around them. So they will get killed faster than usually, you know. Now the Orc Raiders are down to half their strength. Okay, let's do this. Let's attack those mountain trolls, shall we? These guys can't attack anything else, so why not just keep hitting these? Well, actually, they There's shouldn't right now, paper. so let Victory me stop this guy. Out. You know, they still have the auto fire, but it won't fire against these old craters now. I've lost 10%, and that's only to an Olokai unit that it's... Well, they're quite weak right now, so that's fine. And you can see that those old wallers and the mountain trolls are suffering a little bit. Dwarf Raiders are routing, the Yolokai are starting to fall, eight of them, okay, that's cool, actually killing a lot of these guys. How many are Olokai are there? Seven, so it's, we are winning here. And it's a matter of time, because they take a lot of hits. Yeah, six, our men are doing that, go kill those men. Well, don't fall over the river, that's just shameful, come on. 
coming as are doing a good job against the mounted trolls. Well, they're killing anyone that is standing nearby, so that's that's quite cool, I guess. There's only four Olagai, so right now we are winning this pretty easily. Still haven't lost too much. You know, 13, 14%. It's kind of usual when you're fighting Olagai, you know. I still haven't dealt with these guys, but of course this is a bridge battle, guys, so... Um, yeah, that is it. I'm always gonna take some extra casualties. Luckily for me, this is only four Olagai now. Actually, three of them or two of them. There we go. They're not killing any uh, too many right now. Now my archers, these Helmingers, or these early archers might get some some fire there. Okay, this guy is gonna get away. There we go. And now these guys, I'm gonna put them inside. Let's see if I can get some shots off. There we go. Run in. Thank you. Lost things here. They're still killing the... Oh, that's the general, by the way, so that's fine. Let him kill them. And these archers, these earling archers, are going to kill a couple of these maulers. Uh, the mounted trolls, even though I didn't kill them, they are pretty heavily, you know, damaged. Now they're getting a lot of kills. That's cool. So I'm just going to kill this general or this captain from them and keep firing some arrows over there. It's not a lot of arrows though. Good tidings. <laughs> I like this zoom in on the water. Okay, so enemy general is dead and these units, well, they kind of need some space to be able to shoot better. So I think I'm going to move them here. These guys, let's move them in. So. There we go. They're gonna stop and fire. They're gonna stop and fire. Can actually move these guys a little bit backwards. Let's put it times six. Right now, I want any any fire that I can do. There we will go. Just spend the ammunition, right? Now they are spending pretty well. They're killing already one unit here. Kinda. Those orc molars are heavily defeated. So what I want here right now is to get some hits on these guys, just to get you know to diminish these numbers, so that they will have the the, the morale effect of that. And now we have no more fire. So let me approach. Make sure you do like this. You guys are gonna go over here. These guys are gonna go over here. There we go. I couldn't move the riders of the fold, but no need to send them. So I'm gonna send these guys over there. Swords one are gonna go over here. I'm gonna go on the other side. You're gonna go against the mountain trolls. And I'm pretty sure that this is just fighting right now. Yeah, d some of them are already f fleeing we immediately. Like this, we will smash the enemy. So these guys can attack those. There we go. X-Men are doing fine. Let's go over there, Lancers. Pretty sure that these modern drills will die a little bit faster than what they think. Uh, after some of the modern drills are killed, I'm going to send a cavalry because before that, it's going to be dangerous. You know, and I'm pretty sure that I want to get these guys diminished a little bit. Like four. We continue like this, we will smash the enemy. Three, two. Okay, I think I'm actually in the best spot. There's a maulers there, so let's send some cavalry here, some cavalry here. There you go. Send all the cavalry forces. They should do it. You know, this infantry, of course, is going to do some damage, but, you know, it's quite obvious that they're not going to do everything themselves. So at least I can send in the cavalry. Honestly, the cavalry could almost patch, pass through there, even though I think all that I need is the ability from this guy. Yeah, and they're routing now. Not that it diminishes them, but it encourages my troops so that 
you know, the overall result is kind of like the same. So a lot of these guys are now routing, which is perfect. These guys are going to pursue. Only half the enemy force remains. So these guys, let me just send them against the Uruks. You're just going to patch through. There you go, just go through. Whatever you can, there's no more trolls. So it's not like he's going to lose a lot of men. So the Uruks are fighting against dying. There we go. I think we got him. Let's times two. So we got everything there. There's some units there who were fighting to the death. That's why, you know, they they weren't routing or the message that I have won hadn't appeared, even though I have won. So I'm checking 22%. That's good work. That's good work, job. Work, men. That's good job, man. You know, I, I was thinking, good job, man, or good work, man, and then I said, good work, job. <laughs> All right, so 148 casualties inflicted by those Helminga. Wow, that was cool. That was nice. Okay, cool. Hello, kitty. What do you want, kitty? What do you want? Yeah, you just want cuddles. Yeah, she always wants cuddles. Yeah, see. There she is. There is no glory Hello, cutie. In hiding like this, my lord. I spend most of the time playing, you know, with the cats when I'm at home. And playing video games, of course. Come on, kitty. Say hello. Say hi. Hi. How you doing? Bye-bye. Okay. So... No, she's a cat. There's no, there's no problem with me dropping her like that. Okay, so I can uh, besiege Hannah Noon, perhaps, with this army. Uh, I can also merge the units here from Minas Tirith. I think that would be a better idea, honestly. Yes, so, let me merge some units here and send these Eurling swordsmen in. There we go. So, you're going to go here yes. so that you can merge some units with this guy. And we'll have to see yes, that my lord. afterwards. So, I'm going to send this guy here. Uh, what do we have here? Lots of guys. Lord, Lots of guys lord. there. Lots of units to replenish here. Can I train more? Yes, I can. So I'm sending a lot of guys over here, which is quite interesting. Now, I'll have to dispose them by infantry and the archers and whatever, so that I can realize exactly what I need. I think I have a nexus of infantry, which... But, kind of, you never have a nexus of infantry, right? So, what do I want from this King Ilmer? I actually want to, the, to get every single unit that is, you know, suffering. There we go. Let me get these guys away a little bit. Now merge with wh whoever is here that is having the same things. These guys, perhaps not these guys, these guys. Uh, this guy, I didn't have any there. Have these guys here. Let's merge all units there. It's cool. So whoever is complete, let me see what I can, Your what I should provide here. Lord. So I have a ballista, some Rohan riders, riders of the fold in your heavy lances. Let's give him just the steel royal guard and some inherited heavy lances there. There we go. Now I have an Helmingus, an Earling archer, two Earling archers. So I could use two more. And right now, hang on, I do have one good unit of infantry. One bad unit, let's say, you know, just a standard unit. So I need as many infantry units as possible. These guys will do fine. Then I need two more. Okay, so these guys would be fine, and so would these guys. Or actually, something like this would be much better. There we go. Now, can I merge these guys here? I can, and merge units. Well, you'll be able to retrain in a couple of, a couple of moments, of course. So this guy, what do I want from him? Do I want him to go over here? I think so. I think that would be a good idea. You know, the other ones can take care of whatever is coming on over here. Yeah, I think so. So it's time to turn in turn... actually not. Let me check the yes, diplomats. Okay. Very demanding ceasefire. Okay, that's fine. If you don't want a ceasefire, it's cool. Uh, I'm actually yes, going to try to talk with the Harad, I think. Yes. I think that would be a nice idea. Another agent, let me check my this lord. on Reland. 
he has already performed the mission, so let's end up to turn. Now, I'll need to readjust all the armies there. I'll just, you know, check one army and send, you know, build an army for, per army the bases. Um, pretty sure that I'll have some issues here, but oh well. Okay, we're defending on a bridge against the big army from Mordor. That's cool. It's kind of interesting that he decided to attack. Does he have great beasts here? He doesn't. Most of that is good infantry units. I have just the perfect army to face them, I believe. You know. You gotta make sure that I defend properly. But I think this battle will actually be on the next episode, because it's two battles in uh, in a row in the bridge, and these guys... these battles take way too long. So yeah. Sorry guys, that will be a cliffhanger. Or a bridge hanger, if you if you prefer. So thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys on the next episode. Bye bye.